my name is Chelsea DeBruder and I am a Community Services Support Staff Member for the County of Grand Prairie. The former village of Hythe was the recipient of the 2020 Make a Diff Sports Grassroots Community Sport Innovation Challenge grant funding. The community of Hythe had had a void in what had been available for outdoor winter recreation for some time. With minimal hills, no outdoor skating rink, and limited access to public skating times, there was a need for an outdoor winter recreation activity in the community. The former village of Hythe was looking for an innovative way to create a space that was accessible for all ages and abilities. Given the busy schedule of families and community members, the idea of having an activity that was available for spontaneous play was really important. Located in northern Alberta, Hythe winters can feel long. The idea to add an activity that encouraged outdoor play, that required no personal equipment or experience, and fostered an active lifestyle was the inspiration of this project. Hythe was looking for a new and innovative activity that would draw interest in the community and promote wellness through recreation. Croca Curl was something we saw pop up in other Canadian communities and thought it would be a great fit for our northern lifestyle. So what is Croca Curl? The outdoor sport Croca Curl was created by Public City Architectures. It combined the much-loved game of curling and the board game Croconole. Public City has graciously shared the instructions on how to build your own playing surface as well as the rules of the game, which is posted at the Croca Curl rink in Hythe. In Croca Curl, players choose a quadrant. If playing in a team, teammates will choose the quadrant opposite each other and share the same color of curling stone. Players will take turns going in a clockwise rotation, sliding a curling stone on the ice and attempting to get their stones closest to the middle. If a stone falls completely into the center hole, the player will receive 20 points and will immediately remove their stone. These stones are placed to the side and cannot be replayed in the current round. This allows the next player to have the opportunity to also achieve the 20 points associated with having their stone in the center. All other stones remain on the playing surface until the stones have been played. After the rocks have been played by both teams, the scoring is tallied. Depending on where the stones land on the surface, they will score 5, 10, or 15 points. The winner of the match is determined by the player or team who wins the most rounds, for example, best of 1, 3, or 5. Croca Curl has created a recreational outdoor space in the community that fosters spontaneous play and is available to participants of all ages and skill levels. Croca Curl has been an innovative addition to the Hythe community that has drawn interest while promoting wellness through recreation. Hythe has seen participants come from as far as the city of Grand Prairie to play a match. We have also seen Croca Curl rinks pop up in neighboring municipalities this season, confirming the popularity of the game. Make a Diff Sports Grassroots Community Sport Innovation Challenge grant funding was essential in making this project possible in Hythe. The grant funds received were the launch pad to get the Hythe Plays Croca Curl project in motion. The construction and installation of the Croca Curl rink has been made possible through the collaborative efforts of many committed volunteers and recreation supporters. A special thank you to Ed and Marilyn Woloshin, President and members of the Hythe Curling Club, who built the Croca Curl structure, and to the Ray family who welded the steel posts. Thank you to Max McCauley and the Hythe Fire Department, who helped to establish the ice surface, and to the Beaver Lodge Home Hardware Store for donation of materials. This project could not have been possible without the support of the County of Grand Prairie, the Hythe and District Agricultural Society, and the Village of Hythe. We cannot go without thanking the brilliant minds at Public City Architecture who created the design for this amazing game. It has been a wonderful addition to our winter outdoor recreational landscape. The volunteers, supporters, architects, and funders have come together to bring Croca Curl to Hythe. So how has it been going? We can report that the global COVID-19 pandemic has temporarily paused plans to organize community Croca Curl events due to social distancing requirements. Families and individual households are still encouraged to engage in participating in a friendly match while remembering to adhere to the Alberta public health restrictions. 
We look forward to the future when these safety measures are not required and the community can gather again to enjoy a round of Croca Curl. The wonderful thing about this project is that the materials can be used again next season. The Croca Curl rank and materials are stored and reused year after year, which allows this project to continue to promote wellness through outdoor winter recreation for many winter seasons to come. The ability to deconstruct the rink and remove the materials allows the municipality the ability to relocate the structure from year to year. This has become beneficial as we determined in the first year of activity the location chosen was not ideal due to the ground being uneven. We have built the structure in a new location for the 2022 season that has created a new recreational environment and maximized a day use area in another location in Hythe. This environment is welcoming to visitors, families, and community members who wish to enjoy an afternoon of innovative recreation. Because of the generous grant from Make a Diff Sports and the contribution from the volunteers and community supporters, Hythe will play Croca Curl for many years to come. Thank you.